Um, my name is Lisa Marling, and I'm at the barbecue festival. And I'm not real sure what I ate, but it was really good. I know I had some mushrooms, um, some baked potatoes, some jalapeno stuffers. They were really good and hot. Some mango tacos and some kind of salad. It's been great. My name is uh, David Owens. I'm at uh, Franklin, North Carolina, the barbecue festival. Had some great food here. Uh, some jalapeno poppers with bacon wrap, stuffed mushroom, some uh, grandma's uh, meat roast with potatoes and carrots, um, a taco with some mango and some red onions, and barbecue, and I don't want all of that. And uh, some type of bacon wrapped about 10 pieces deep. Sure was good. You mean you think it's gone? Yes, sir. It's gone. I got the last bite in my mouth. I am uh, Warren Cabe, and we're in Franklin, North Carolina at the Barbecue Festival, and I have had some stuffed mushrooms, which are really good, and I think my favorite is probably a barbecue taco with some mango and some jalapeno and some red onion mixed in. Very good. My name's Debbie Wallace, and I'm at the Barbecue Festival in Franklin, North Carolina. And I think my favorite is the stuffed um, jalapeno pepper, but we've had some really good um, stuffed mushrooms and uh, barbecue taco. Everything was really good. <coughs> my name is Summer Woodard, and we're in Franklin, North Carolina. We had some outstanding dishes tonight. I think my favorite has to be so far is the jala stuffed jalapeno. We had some really good mango tacos and a really good stuffed mushroom. Uh, Jimmy Team, and I'm in Franklin, North Carolina, and I like the jalapeno poppers and the stuffed mushroom. They were good. Thank you all very much. I'm Ronnie Bill at the 7th Annual <clears throat> Mountain High Barbecue, and we've just had wonderful food. Uh, we just now finished dessert. If you can see the plate, we had blueberry cake, chocolate-covered cheesecake, a blueberry biscuit with a little round ball that was really good, uh, pineapple upside down cake and bourbon we think uh, apple pie so you can't be we had and also we had good food and anything but uh, probably the best food we've had we've been coming for the past several years and and uh, certainly these these cooks have done a wonderful job Pass it on there. well he said most of everything uh, Everything was great. Uh, good taste, good flavor. Um, I didn't see anything bad about anything. Been doing this since it started, and this is some of the prettiest and best tasting food we've had. I, too, have been doing it since we started, and the desserts are always my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> I've been doing this too since we started. Very, very good desserts tonight. Hello, I'm Larry Wallace. I'm from Franklin, North Carolina. I've been doing it for seven years, and it's been great every time. I really enjoy it. Dry number six had a little more heat than I liked. 
overall it was a uh, pretty good chicken um number five was probably my favorite and my least favorite was number three it was uh, had a little too much heat uh that came uh, afterwards yeah this was a really good batch of chicken actually um turns out my favorite was number one i, I really liked that uh, my least was uh, one two three four it was five um it was a little uh uh, tough, in, in my opinion. Um, overall, the chicken was very good. Number one and number six were my favorite. Number three was my least favorite. Uh, my piece was very dry. All right, my favorites probably were number one and number two, and it went downhill after that. Um, uh, the uh, uh, number five was or number four was probably the worst. It was very tough. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> of these samples, number three was my favorite. Felt he hit it on his uh, cook and the flavoring. Uh, two and four were very close. They seemed to be just a little overcooked. Four are, yeah, four and six, definitely the worst of this group. For myself, uh, number one was the most flavorful. Number six was the least flavorful. In fact, it's a sad story there. Um, I'm going to have to pass this okay. on now. <laughs> I just run out of bed. <laughs> My favorites were number one and number two. Least favorites were four and six, but I think all of them fell short in terms of being cooked. I think they were all either overcooked with the exception of number six. That was very undercooked. I thought number one was the best and probably four and six were the worst, but overall I thought it was a very average run of ribs in general. Number one, number two were the best. Number four and six, you couldn't even chew into it. Very disappointing run of ribs. I liked number one the best. I like a little spice. Um, it was a tad dry, but the flavor was very good to me, and I love the pulled pork. Um, my least favorite was number four. Um, it was a little overcooked, had good overall color, but just not my favorite. Uh, my least favorite was um, probably number two. I just thought it lacked flavor, was a little dry. Um, and probably my favorite was uh, number five. I did think it was a little salty, but overall I thought it had a great amount of flavor. My least favorite was also number two. Oh, very dry. Uh, my favorites were five and six. I thought they had the most flavor and were uh, the tenderest of the bunch. I'd have to say my least favorite was probably number two. Got a little bit of mushy side. Uh, it was cooked okay uh, flavor-wise, but it just had that mushy flavor to it. And uh, probably number six was my favorite. That, that one was darn good. I love that one there. So I'd, I'd rate that one any day. Number six is good. Had a little bit of, little bit of a kick to it, but it had nice tenderness. Very nice. And I would probably have to agree. Number two was dry. Uh, it just to me, it also didn't have the flavor that I was looking for. Number six was pretty good. It had the tenderness, it had the flavor, and it was a pretty good entry. Yes, I'd agree with that. Uh, number two was dry, and number four was mushy, maybe uh, injection or what have you. Number six tasted really good, but again, it was like a lot of injection or something. I, I didn't taste a lot of pork. I get a lot of sauce and whatever else with it, but it was good. Okay, my favorite was number one. It had a good flavor. It was tender, and my least favorite was number three. My least favorite was number three. It had a peculiar taste. My Two favorites were four and six. Six was tender and it tasted more um, like beef. How long is your arm? 
I guess number three was my least favorite. Number four and number six would have been my most favorite of, of the pick. Uh, number four was, I thought, had the best flavor. It had uh, so much of it, it was bland in the other entries. It just did not have any taste. I agree that number four was a favorite. I think the texture as well as the flavor was just right on, uh, followed by number six. And uh, number three, both the flavor and the texture uh, earned it the last place spot at our table. <laughs> Once it goes in there, it's up to me. Stinking ass jokes.